Hello friends, in this video I want to show you how I can separate iron filings from the dust I have all over my workshop. I need some iron filings to do an experiment and uh, instead of filing away a, a bit of iron I'm going to collect it from what I already have. Uh, usually when I use my bench grinder the filings stay inside there so I can take off this cover and take out of the collector all the filings I have there. Hmm? But I don't want to do that. Instead, when I've used my angle grinder, I usually have some filings left over all over the place. Hmm? On top of the, the workshop desk, the table, on the floor. Now it's clean but I just picked it all up. And uh, there is still a bit left over. I could have picked that up also. Once I've picked up all the dust from the floor and from off my workshop table with a good magnet, an odymium magnet, I come over and I pick up all I can, all the iron fines I find, mixed up with a whole lot of other stuff, and I put it here. I collect all I can. Of course here I've got big chunks of iron also. Hmm? Put a lot of stuff. After doing that, I make it go through a sieve. Now, get it through the sieve is 0.5 millimeters sieve that gets rid of all the big stuff now this is a mixture of bits of wood aluminum and brass maybe hmm? and that I put it on this little table hmm? this is a plastic quite thick solid didn't move around too much and with my little magnet what I do is I get hold of the and start moving it around put it around a little bits with this way with that way trying to separate it from non magnetic stuff and once I've separated a bit I remove all the dust and I keep on moving it till I'm sure I've got rid of most of the dust hmm? always small amounts small amounts that I can move, that I can capture with my magnet. And once I've got all the non-black stuff out, then I can pick it up and put it where I'm going to keep all my iron filings. My can full of black filings. Hmm? I can also put all this dust in a glass of water. The little bits of wood and will, will float to the top. The iron filings will sink to the bottom of the glass and all the rest of fine material will dissolve in the water and I can skim it all off. Hmm? I can do that and then after with the magnet separate the iron from other heavy material. When we grind iron with a grinding stone or with a grinding disc the material of the stone uh, comes off together with the, the iron filings. But we can separate that from the filings using ma a magnet. To separate the iron filings from other materials like wood so on what we have to do 
is in a glass of water you just throw it in a good amount we mix mix it now all the stuff that is that floats that can float we'll we can just take it off by throwing the water out all the dust will stay in dissolved in the water we have to separate the yarn firing from anything that is floating so it goes to the bottom and just no. You can put more water in to make sure we aren't dropping any iron filings down. Little by little it is the water is getting clearer now all we have is the heavy stuff that is at the bottom hmm? however now we're going to have to wait for it to dry before we can separate yarn from other stuff. And that's it. Hmm? There we have our iron and other heavy material in there. We have to wait for it to dry now and then we can separate it with the magnet. We can help the drying process by putting it on a bit of absorbing paper. There it will dry a bit faster. there should be dry enough just to use a magnet to separate the iron from other heavy things. So let's try it. That's it. I uh, hope you like this mini video. Please, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.